All positive, all negative, some negative. What does it mean here? Some positive. Whenever you find there is some relation between two variables, that means some positive relation between the these two entity. For an example, example is given over here. Like some A R B. If some A R B is given over here, it doesn't matter. We will write over here A first or B first. We can write here B or A. It doesn't matter. We can say that there is an equal relation between A to B. Both side same relation between A and B. Whenever you find this statement like all A R B, here it means all part of first variable within the circle of second second variable. So what is the diagram of this this statement like all A R B? It means all part of A within the circle of B. Do remember this is the area where this is the area where all A R exist and some B R exist. If any statement you can find that all A R B here it means all the area of A is here and some area of B is already available here. But we cannot comment about this area of B. We will talk in further uh, further in further slide. We will talk about it. Let's proceed toward the third statement, which is saying all A R not B. Here it means all part of first variable will not go in the area of second variable, and vice versa. All part of second variable will not come in the area of first variable. It means answer will be same from both the side. All A R not B. All B R not A. Some A R not B. Some B R not A. Let's move on towards the next question. Next statement is saying some not. Do remember while answering this type of a statement that some A R not B. Here it means only first variable, some part of first variable will not go in second part, second variable. Here it means some part of A is not B. But we cannot comment over here regarding B to A. We can conclude that some part of A is not B. But we cannot conclude regarding B to A because we don't have any information regarding B up to A. Let's talk about the conclusion. What type of conclusion they can ask from you on behalf of these statement? These are the four basic general statement. Whenever you find this statement, it can be some other word. In another word, in another word, we can say it is no A is B or all A are not B. Both are same. Don't confuse over here. All A are not B same means no A is B. Let's proceed towards the conclusion. If any of the statement is given to you, generally sixteen conclusion can be asked from the examiner. It is up to your examiner that he will ask two conclusion, three conclusion, or four conclusion. But you have to aware about each and every conclusion regarding your statement. If any of the statement is given, it is the right of your examiner that what type of conclusion they will ask within the these sixteen conclusion. These are sixteen general conclusion like some A R B. This is on behalf of A. All A R B on behalf of A. Some A R not B on behalf of A. And all A R not B on behalf of A. These four are the conclusion on behalf of A in definite manner. And four regarding B to A. In definite manner, like you can see here, some B R A, all B R A, some B R not A, all B R not A. These eight are the definite case of any of the statement. These eight are general basic case of your on the point of view of your exam. These eight are the basic concept of possibility. These are eight are possible case. Like 
समय कैन बी बी हेयर इट मीन पॉसिबल दैट इट कैन बी पॉसिबल समय समय कैन बी बी दिस इज अनदर केस ऑफ पॉसिबिलिटी ऑल ए आर बी इज ए पॉसिबिलिटी सम ए आर नॉट बी इज ए पॉसिबिलिटी सम ऑल ए आर नॉट बी इज ए पॉसिबिलिटी और वी कैन से दैट नो ए आर बी इज ए पॉसिबिलिटी और वी कैन से दीज फोर आर ऑन बी ऑफ ए एंड रेस्ट ऑफ फोर आर ऑन बी ऑफ ऑफ बी लाइक सम बी कैन बी ए ऑल बी कैन बी ए सम बी आर नॉट ए इज ए पॉसिबिलिटी ऑल बी आर नॉट एज ए पॉसिबिलिटी you have to be aware about each and every conclusion about all the variables so do remember what are they work and how we can conclude all the conclusion regarding the statement do remember we cannot go beyond the statement we have to aware about the statement first then we have to decide what are the conclusion can be true in possible case and what are the definite conclusion is true within the statement With the help of a statement, let's have a look. As you can see here, we have taken here definite and possible case together. We have taken for you, so that will be benefit beneficial for you. If we talk about some positive, you can easily be aware about it because we have already mentioned that some positive statement like some A B, some pen or pencil, some one or two. If whenever you find a statement like all positive. Here it means a statement like all A B, all pen or pencil, all Indian are honest, all K are J, like etc. and etc. Do remember about these. So any of the statement, generally sixteen conclusion can be asked, which we have so showed you earlier. Now first statement is saying some A B or we can say that some Indian are honest and so on. Doesn't matter what is written over here, just do just aware about the functioning of these two variable in the case of some positive whenever you find there is some relation between two entities like a and b or one or two or any or on s doesn't matter do remember about this circle this is the area of definite case which is written in definite manner and this is the area of possibility while answering the question do remember that relation between the two variables are same or different here we can see that both of the relation between these two entity are same if sum a b that means sum b r a it does it doesn't matter it hardly matters to us that we are talking about b or we are talking about a it doesn't matter about the conclusion we have same conclusion regarding this statement because both side same relation whenever you find both time both side same relation whenever you find the case of some positive here it means first conclusion as you can see here in indefinite manner examiner wants to know that some a r b you can see over here yes we can say that some part of a is b or on behalf of b we can say that some b r a it is definitely true if examiner wants to know about all a r b or all b r a we cannot conclude in definite manner that all about all a or all b because we have only sufficient information regarding a to b third conclusion is saying some a r not b it is definitely true answer will be we don't know about the rest of part we know we have about a to b we have very sufficient information like some positive we cannot conclude negative conclusion we cannot conclude negative conclusion here that's why all the negative conclusion is false in definite manner do remember if positive statement is given then answer will be in a positive manner if negative statement is given then conclusion will be negative manner if examiner wants to know about in definite case do remember it positive information positive conclusion negative information negative conclusion in definite manner now be aware about the possibilities these all are the possibility how can you solve the possibility like you can see here first examiner wants to know that it is possible that some a or b we can easily say that it cannot be possible because it is it have already done that it is a definite statement so that's why this conclusion is false that some a or b is a possibility is false vice versa some b or a is a possibility is false why it is false because definitely we are aware that some part of b is a and definitely we are aware that some part of a is b 
second conclusion which is written over here all a k r b is a possibility you can see here we already have some positive information if rest of part will be positive then what is the result we have got we have got all the circle is positive so that's why answer will be all positive case is true here that all b a can be b is a possibility same all b can be a is a possibility is true while answering the question of some positive in given in a statement third conclusion is saying some a are not b is a possibility yes why it is true because rest of part we can do that if this part will not go in the area b then this conclusion is true that some a are not b is a possibility vice versa some b are not a is a possibility yes it can be true if this part will not go in a circle of a last conclusion is saying all a are not b is a possibility then answer will be it cannot be a possibility because already they have mentioned that there is some positive relation between a and b so answer will be false what are the answer you can conclude when the statement is some positive do remember we can conclude only three conclusion here regarding a and three conclusion regarding b like some positive and all positive and some negative these two are in possible case and this one is definite case so let's proceed towards the statement as you can see here a statement is given all a are not b or no is b it doesn't matter what is written over here all in here are not on s all one are not two all five are not six is it hardly matters so first all a are not b is given in the statement we have to make the diagram like all a are not b you can see here we have all the information regarding a and we have all the information regarding b if we have all the information regarding a and all the information regarding b and what is extra we know about, about these two that they all are functioning same they all have same relation between them it means answer will be both the side, side are same if we say all a are not b all b are not a answer will be true if we say some a are not b and some b are not a answer will be true because all a are not b is true so that's why we can say all b are not a is true why it is true if any of the part of b will come in the circle of a then the statement will go false and we cannot go beyond the statement do remember it that now in this question what type of conclusion examiner can ask from you and what type of answer you will give to the examiner if a statement is all a or not b first conclusion is positive answer will be false because it is they are talking about definite second conclusion is positive answer will be false because if a statement is negative then answer will be negative in definite manner first third conclusion is saying some a are not b it is definitely true answer will be true we can say that if all a are not b then answer will be some a are not b is definitely true next all a are not b it is true then answer will be it is again true because it is already have mentioned in the statement now two answer on behalf of a as we have mentioned earlier that both sides same answer so answer both sides same answer so here it we here we means both sides same answer here we means that these two are true on behalf of b also that some b are not a it is true and all b are not a it is also true examiner can be asked from you that no a is b or no b is a that are also true if any time you know all the things about variables all the things about these two variables then the possibility doesn't exist between them because if you have all the information about a thing that they that it cannot be a case of possibility because you have all the information regarding a to b in definite manner so if examiner wants to know about possibility that some a can be b is a possibility that you can easily say that all a are not b then how can it possible that some a are b second conclusion all a r b is a possibility answer will be false because we already know that all a r definitely not b some a r not b is a possibility answer is again false because a to b relation is already definitely exist all a r not b again false because this is already written in the statement that all a r definitely not b again we are telling you that if any time you will find 
if any time you have all the information regarding a statement like you have all the information about your result if you are passed in all the subject or we can say that if you are failed in all the subject that then it will not be a case of possibility because you can talk about in definite manner that you are passed in your exam or you are failed in your exam then do remember if you aware about all the things about a circle then it will never be a case of possibility then you can ask in you can tell the conclusion in case of definite manner let's proceed toward the next con next statement all a r b all in here are honest all one are two whenever you are find this type of a statement then first variable within the circle of smaller one and second variable within the circle of larger one all a r b as you can see here in this time relation between these two variable are different so answer will be b focus by answering the question that examiner wants to know from you on behalf of a or on behalf of b now we are talking about all the option regarding a for definite and for possible and after that we will talk about all the case of b for definite and for uh, possible let's talk about the statement as you can see here we know we have definite information about a and what information we have got we have all the information about a to b in definite manner in in positive sense so first conclusion sum a b is true second conclusion all a r b it is also true third conclusion is talking about negative if a statement is positive then answer will be in a positive manner so last two conclusion is false or in other word we can say that inward to outward only two answer will be true in definite case that is all positive and some positive if examiner wants to know about a to b in possibility case we have told you earlier if you have all the information regarding first variable to second then it cannot be a possible case because you can talk about all the things regarding a in definite manner which you have already done so answer will be all the case regarding a to b in possibility possibility answer will be false like all a some a r b is a possibility answer will be false because it is already have mentioned in the question all a r b is a uh, all a r b is a possibility answer will be false some a r not b is a possibility answer it cannot be possible because there is a direct positive relation between a and b last all a r not b is a possibility again false because a to b 100% definite positive relation exists between a to b let's talk about b to a what is the relation between b to a same circle all a r b as we have told you earlier only some positive relation between b to a which is exist in the circle of a so we can conclude only one definite conclusion regarding b to a that some b are a which is exist in the circle of a if examiner wants to know that all b are a answer will be false because we cannot conclude about all part of b next negative information false negative conclusion false if a statement positive then conclusion in definite manner in is true positive let's talk about the conclusion regarding possibility from point of view of b first conclusion is saying some b are a is a possibility we can say that if some b are already a then how can it possible that some b are a we can say we have already about we have already information regarding some positive that it cannot be a case of possibility second conclusion is saying all b r a is a possibility now what to do this area we have say that we have to say that this is already positive regarding b to a if rest of area will go positive then the circle between a to b which will which can be possible like a will equals to b then we can say that all b r a is a possibility it can be true in the case of possibility third conclusion is saying some b r not a is a possibility if rest of area of b will not go in the area of a then answer will be true that some area of b is not in the area of a so that's why answer will be true that some b are not a is a possibility it is true last all b are not a is a possibility it cannot be a possibility because it is definitely true that some b are a if some positive is given that it cannot be a possibility that all area will not be in a circle of a Let's proceed towards the next question. 
Some A are not B, some Indian are not an A, some one are not two, some pen are not pencil. Do remember by answering the question that this is a some negative relation between these two entity that A saying some part of A is not B. But we cannot conclude anything about B to A. So answer will be which is we are talking about in this time on the point of view of A. In definite manner, information is negative. So we can conclude only one thing in definite manner that some A are not B, which is written in a statement number, conclusion number third. All the rest of option are false. Why they are false? Because a statement is negative. Conclusion cannot be positive in definite manner. Fourth conclusion is saying all A are not B. Answer will be we in definite manner we cannot conclude about all all part of A. We can conclude about only this part of A that some A are not B. Let's talk about the possible case of A. Some A are B is a possibility. We have definite information regarding this part that this part will not go in the area of B. But rest of part can be go in the area of B. So we can say that this can be a possible case of A to B. Second conclusion is saying all B are, all A or B is a possibility. Indefinitely, indefinite, we can say that some A are not B, that it cannot be a case of possibility that all A can be B. Let's talk about the third conclusion. Some A are not B is a possibility. Answer will be it is already mentioned in the statement that some A are not B, then it is not a case of possibility. Last, in last they are talking about all A are not B is a possibility or no A is B is a possibility, then it is a case of possible because in definite we have no some negative. If rest of part is already negative in case of possibility, then answer will be all A will not go in, in this area of B, then it can be a possibility that all A are not B is a possibility. So do remember, if some negative information is given, then only three conclusions can be true regarding first variable like some negative, all positive, all negative in possibility and some positive in case of possibility as we have mentioning you one by one, one by one. Let's talk about B to A. If we talk about on behalf of B that a statement is some A or not B. Do remember we have to know that we cannot go beyond the statement. A statement is talking about some A or not B. In this statement, we cannot, we don't have anything about any, we don't have any information regarding B to A. It means in definite manner, we cannot conclude anything about B because neither we have positive information, neither we have negative information regarding B. So all the case of definite are false. Whenever you find there is no information is given, given to you from one variable to second, then all the possible case are true with reference to B to A. We are again telling you if no information is given regarding, if you don't have any information regarding B to A, then all the possibility are follow here that some B can be A, it can be a possibility, all B can be A, it can be a possibility, some A are not B, some B are not A is a possibility and all B are not A is a possibility. We are, uh, we are mentioning the diagram over here, let's check. Some positive, how can be a possible diagram of this? That some B R A is a possibility and still the information is true that some A R not B. Second, all, how can it possible that all B R A? This is the possible diagram of all B R A and some A R not B. Still this statement is true. We cannot go beyond the statement and we have fulfilled the requirement of this statement that some A R not B. Third, some, A R not, some B R not A. If some A R not B, then it is a possible case that some part of B will not go in the area of A. And last but not the least, all B are not A. How can it possible? Some A are not B, still we know. And all B are not A, it is a possible case. So we can say that these 1, 2, 3, 4 are possible case, which you can see over here, that all the possible case regarding B to A is true. Let's proceed toward the question that with the help of the basic criteria of all the statement and all the conclusion. Now, how can you solve question which are related to your exam? As you can see here, first question is talking about all 1 or 7. First variable within the circle of inward 
and second variable within the circle of outward. Next, all seven are eight, which means all seven are eight. Some seven are nine, it means some seven are include nine. And last, all nine are not ten, which means no nine is ten. These are the statement, and these are the diagrammatic diagrammatical representation of this statement. Now we have to conclude one by one about each and every conclusion. All nine can be seven, as you can see here. That there is some positive relation between nine to seven. We have told you earlier in this case, like here, if some positive information is given, either it is about a to b, or it is a, it is about seven to nine, or about nine to eight, then only two cases will be follow in the case of possibility, like all positive and some negative. Do check it over here and cross check it again and again. Now, what type of answer you can give? They are talking about all nine can be seven. It is a case of possibility. Yes, it is a possibility. This is a already definite case in positive manner. If this this area will go in seven, then answer will be true that all nine can be seven. Second conclusion is talking about all eight can be ten. There is a direct relation between eight to ten that some part of eight, which is in the area of nine, will not go in ten. So in definite manner, we have aware that some eight are not ten. That how can it possible that all eight can be ten? So answer will be false. That all eight are can be ten. It is. It cannot be a possibility. Next, some seven are not ten. We can easily say that some seven are nine. That's why some seven are not ten because we have already aware that all nine are not ten. So that's why this conclusion is true that some nine are not ten. Last conclusion is saying some one are some one are not ten. Not any information is given by the examiner to us that one about one to ten. If we don't have any information, no information, we have no information regarding these two entity, then answer will be false because they are talking about in definite manner. So that's why right answer of this question will be option number first and third is true. Let's move on towards the next question. Some J are not K. Some negative information is given that some J. Are not k. Always some negative. Do remember the single set relation that only some j are not a. Uh, some j are not k. It doesn't mean mean that some k are not j. We have concluded regarding j to k, but we cannot have any information about definite manner regarding k to j. Second statement is saying all k are j. Still we don't aware about j to k and j to z. We have aware. We have information regarding j to k. But we don't have information regarding J to Z. Neither we have information regarding J to Z, nor we have information regarding Z to J. Next statement is saying some Z are H. A last statement is saying all J are W. Here it means if all J are W in this circle, all J are exists in this, and some W are exists in this. First conclusion is talking about all W can be H. You can see here. No information is given regarding W to H. Then all the possibility will be true. Either it is definitely positive or it will be negative. We have again telling you if no information is given regarding first variable to second, and examiner wants to know from you about these two entity in the case of possibility, then answer will be true. Let's proceed towards the next conclusion. All J can be Z. You can see here. There is no information is given regarding J to Z. We have information regarding J to K, but we don't have information regarding J to Z. Then again, the case of possibility, then answer will be true. Next conclusion is saying some W are not K. Yes, some part of W are exist in J. So that's why some W are not K. It is definitely true. Last conclusion is talking about some W can be K. We have information regarding W to K is some negative, but rest of part we cannot we we cannot conclude in definite manner, but we can conclude it in possibility. Examiner wants to know that it is possible that some part of W this area will go in circle of K. Yes, it is a possibility. Why it is a possibility? Again, we are telling you if some negative information is given in definite manner, like W to K, some negative information is given. Then only two possibility will be there. First one, 
all negative and second one sum positive so an examiner wants to know from us that sum w can be k means sum positive so that's why this possibility will be true answer will be of this question all conclusions are follow let's move on towards the next question sum a b we can easily draw the diagram of this statement no b is c here it means no b is c that all b are not c as well as all c are not b third statement is saying sum c r d we can easily draw the diagram and last statement is saying all e r b all e r b it means all area of e within the circle of b but we cannot relate e to b first conclusion is saying any of the a can be c here it means all the part of a which means any means we can relate it all any of the a can be c we cannot say that any of the a can be c if a statement if in the conclusion it is written that some a can be c then answer will be true why it will be true because this area will can go in the area of c but in this time they are talking about all a can be c you can see here some a are already not c in definite manner so how can it possible that any of the a can be c so that's why answer of this question will be false second conclusion is saying any of the c can be a you can see over here all c are not b and all c are not e as well but we cannot relate c to a we have the definite information regarding a to c but we don't have information regarding c to a it means all the possible case regarding c to a are true that's why this possibility is true that all c can be go in the area of c like here next sum a can never be c here it means can never you can see that never means definite case it is a definite case that sum a can never be c we cannot we can conclude in definite manner that this area this is known as sum a sum a are not c we can say that sum a can never be c it is definitely true last conclusion is saying all c r d is a possibility there is some positive relation between c to d as you can see here some c r d then if this area will be will go in case of d then answer will be all c r d is a possibility answer will be true why if some positive is given only two possibility will be exist in the, that circle first one all positive second one some negative and examiner wants to know about all positive like all crd it is known as all positive statement in a case of possibility that's why answer is true so the right answer of this question will be conclusion second third and fourth all are true let's proceed to our next question now you can see some different word only a r b here means all b r a if any time you will find only pen or pencil we will conclude it all pencil are pen if you find only one or two here it means all two are one now only a r b means all b are one second statement is state that sum a r c third is states that sum c r d and last states that sum d r e conclusion first no a is e a statement is positive conclusion is negative in definite manner that's why it is false that we cannot conclude about a to e second conclu conclusion is saying no c is d is a possibility already c to d some positive relation is there so it cannot be a possible that all c are not d so that's why conclusion number second is false third sum a r e we cannot conclude about a to e either it will be a positive or negative that's why it is a false now you can see over here first statement is saying no a is e third is saying sum a r e if first statement is true then third one is false if third one is true then first word is false so it will be a case of either or because if any time you will find no and some positive information regarding the two entities and you have which you don't have any information regarding that so answer will be either first or first or true or third will be true this is a case of either or let's talk about the last is conclusion all crd is a possibility yes it is a possibility because if some positive is given then answer will be in a case of positive it can be possibility that all c can be go in the circle of d that's why we can say that answer of this question will be 
either conclusion first or third true and conclusion fourth is definitely true let's proceed towards the next and last question of this is uh, this uh, discussion all one are two statement first is saying all one are two second is saying all two are three next one is saying some one are not four and last is saying all four are five first conclusion some two are not four yes we can say that some two are not four why some two are not four because in this circle do you remember all one are there some two are here and some three are here that's why some two are not four this is definitely true some two can be four rest of part will go on behalf of four in case of possibility so it can be possible that some part of two can go can read with the circle of four so answer will be true third conclusion some one or two is a possibility it is a definite statement that all one or two so how can it possible that some one or two is a possibility because it is already written in the statement that all one or two last conclusion is saying some five are not four is a possibility only some positive relation between five to four then rest of part will go in case of possibility that so that we can say that some five this part of five are not four it can be a possibility so right answer of this question will be conclusion first second and fourth are true that's all about today's discussion we have tried our best that you can score with the help of this discussion you can score more and more your examination so be patient while uh, while uh, answering the question and be focused about the keyword do remember all the case of possibility and definite and don't try to overcome all the problem don't try to combine all your problems be focused towards your goal thank you